Hey guys, me, Clone Trooper X39 here on the main channel doing what I got at Bricks Cascade 2013. I thought I'd make that all dramatic. Okay, so let's get into what I got at Bricks Cascade. We'll start off with the big stuff, then we'll move over to all the brick arms and little custom stuff. So, since Operation Takedown won Best Battlefield, let me put that back on there. Best Battlefield, um, we got this set, so me, Aaron, and Ryan parts drafted it, and this is what I got, I got all those parts, and then these are the minifigures I got out of it, I bought the Han Solo at the convention, so I only got three minifigures, um, and then we, I bought these, I got three palm trees, so those are nice, those are five dollars each. I got this at bulk. This was seven dollars. You got a lot of rare colors in there, so that was worth it. And then here is what I got at the speed build parts draft. All these pieces of these are minifigures, black pieces, just all sorts of pieces in there. And there's really nice pieces in there, like little one by ones and stuff like that. So that was awesome. And in that speed build. I can close this up. Okay, I don't think I can close this up, but in that speed build, I got this 36 by 36 or 32 by 32 gray or tan base plate. Um, so that was awesome as well. This is all bulk, so I got a bunch of rare colors I stocked up on. I got a bunch of sand green, dark green. I got a bunch of dark tan, which is awesome. I got this light lime green, a bunch of lime green, a bunch of orange, um, just a bunch of some of the rare colors, um, got like some of the old gray, you know, just kind of stuff to stock up on, I got this, that was a score, same with this trans plate, and I got like some, you know, like big doors, like little rock pieces, and just a bunch of great stuff in there, some dark red and stuff like that. So, um, also on the goodie bag, I got like some stickers, those are great, uh, then Kate Madness did these capes. What's funny is they had t-shirts with these on them and they're, they're not supposed to do Lego minifigures on t-shirts but they did the two most popular minifigures out of like 2012 so they got in big trouble from Lego by that. Um, got my dog tags I wore there and then here's the card for Operation Takedown so I'm gonna keep that by the trophy. And I know the trophy's not too good but for my first mock bring I've never brought a mock to convention until now, and for bringing my first mock to convention and being at my first collaboration, we won an award. That's pretty good. I'll take it even if it's a kind of a little dorky trophy, but I'll take that. Um, okay, I won that set as well, and then I also won, I don't know if I showed you this, I won that Lord of the Rings set. So I won those two sets. That I'm going to keep sealed in the box. I already have another one. And like that many figures are already worth like $20. So I'm going to keep those sealed and tuck those away for later when I'm older. Okay, now onto the brick arms and stuff. We're going to start up here. These are some prototypes I got trading. I got like, um, a, these are rare because Will normally, Will equals brick arms. That's all I'm going to say. Um, or he's the owner of brick arms. Um, but normally he doesn't print on prototypes. So those are rare. I got a pod gun, a halo gun. Two bone jacks, that knife, V1 minigun, some Tron discs, because I'm in love with Tron. Um, a gold saber, some short shot stuff, core burner, um, all sorts of stuff. FMG that's gunmetal and rubber. Um, also, I got all these. These are all prototypes. I got an XSR shotgun shells and some rare camo prints. Um, also got that as well. I got these XSRs. I got this pistol. I got six of these um, 40 millimeter grenade shells. These are I got some in gunmetal and some in black. These will be for sale on my Flickr, or at least some of them. So those are all prototypes. I got the M6, the new M16 crate that comes with 15 magazines. So I'll have a review on that later. So I'll set that aside. I got the ice pack for reviewing. I got all the offensive combat weapons in production. Got I'm gonna review those. I got three Delta Ops. Now, these are really rare because these are the last of them. Um, G.I. Brick or Julie, she brought the last of them. These are the last of them. I'm probably going to keep it. I'm definitely keeping at least one, and two are going to be f probably for resale. So, 
The bidding will go on Flickr probably, so I'll review one of those as well. I got a bunch, I got 10 Splazers for $15 a piece. Some of these will be for resale and some are for my personal collection. Um, there's my badge, really awesome. Um, already showed you those. I got some cool colored heads. I'm probably going to make a balaclava kind of print and print on those. I got this crate that came with browning and stuff. So, and Then I got these two packs, the Axis and the Allied Force pack. I'll have reviews of those up on my channel as soon as possible. So I'm just kind of making some piles as I go. I got all these are sprues from Will. So he said you can have whatever you want. So I was like, okay, I'll take the sprues. Um, I got... Some of these, um, these are not Lego, these are um, grass pieces, and then I got some sandbags. I have more of these, and they're like custom painted. Um, I got this guy, this is Havoc from Brick Brigade, custom printed. I got him the helmets um, in a case I have. The only problem I had with this figure is there was like brasso all around the neck and in the torso and around the arms, and that's just something I'm, I'm not, I don't like that. I picked up one Mystery Pack Volume 3, just for the heck of it. Um, a fan actually gave this to me. This is um, a v version 1 Brick Arms pack with some Brick Arms in it, so thank you. Um, I got, I think I got, yeah, I got another one of these M16 crates because of the mags. Um, here's some Brick Brigade stuff I got, and Brick Warriors. I got some Flesh Hands. I got some Halo 4 armor and kind of a gunmetal. I got an RPG just for the heck of it, and they had one of these printed um, German things left, so I got that. I got a Spectre, and the Spectre came with this bloody rare camo, so I got that. I got this, and then it came with a Chrome M1 Grand for like five dollars, so that was really good. I or like three dollars actually, and I did it just for the parts. I um, I got some crates here, so those are going to be for you. Got some other printed crates, and these will did just for our collaboration mock. Operation take down there and th I made packs and those are the packs like That's printed that is just awesome. So thank you so much will um, These are the figures from that Lord of the Rings set. I won so I went over all of this um, Here's some Lego items. I bought I bought the DJ for the parts. Um, I got This guy for the legs and the parts as well um, I got this guy for the parts. I got these for a dollar. Four chains for a dollar. I got these from Aaron, my good friend. Um, got this for the parts. Um, all these I got for the parts, and they're great parts. I actually got that from Lego Guy Three Zero, and then they come with some like random accessories that aren't too important. Um, now on to these other brick arms. These are the new production weapons. We got the DP-28, the Brown, and the M60. So I'll have reviews on those. Um, I got a bunch of Spectre heads. Those will be for trade and sale. Got some Spectre legs for trade and sale eventually. These I got... These are some rare brick arms torsos. That one's really rare. Um, I got some chrome ammo tabs and chains. So that's awesome. I traded with Ryan, my good friend that did the collab with me as well. For this Tron guy, and then this one, this one I made a figure of. I thought that looked pretty cool. Um, then I got all these brick arms. We got like shotgun shells, some of the new production, and some cool stuff. Just a little bit of that. And that's pretty much all I got at the convention, guys. So thank you so much for watching. I also won this t-shirt. It has like tools on it, so that's pretty cool. That's pretty much it, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.